Hey, so this is Super SuperZombie God Barbecue, and today, as you can see by this ring domination progress here, we are about to get put on the list finally for the second time. Taking a couple of days to get it this time, but hey, I just made the list. Stupid idiots. And I'm happy about it as well, because this card looks good, hella good stats. Not just that, it loses to Jack Gallagher in free stats. Yeah. I said about this in my last video. Go check it out if you haven't seen it already. However, I'm going to show you now how you make a Jack Gallagher. JC Nova knows 500 bits again. Damn, I was going to give you, uh, going to give you this and say what bar. Uh, Kane did it instead. Oh damn. Okay. Uh, that's that's well. Thank you so much. Thank you for being so generous. It's, Amazing. Thank you so much. I'm going to show you how to make that Jerry Killer, as I called him, that Jack Gallagher card. We're going to get that right now. We're then going to finish off this ring domination. We're going to get Chris Jericho. Look at all the images, and then we've got a fusion cooking. I can't wait to get it. So let's go over to Jack Gallagher, and now I can actually train him up to the max. Uh, bye bye, Rusev. He's not going to be fully leveled, but you know what? He's about as close as he's going to get to it. Uh, yep, and then power. Uh, toughness and charisma. Charisma, and then I put the rest on speed so he beats McFoley. So that's tough as charisma. Uh, at least he beats McFoley in two stats. He does kind of suck when you compare to McFoley, though, which, which, is, which is terrible, but you know, it's the best you can do with that card. He's still the best event card by like a country mile. Chris Jarrah Kizzle is ours. A match for you. you and I don't even read his name. I just I'm guessing what it is. One well, no, is it's Matt. It's Matt. Uh, Matt's for you to NV. And if you like what you're seeing in this upload, make sure you leave a huge like on this video. If we can hit this with a lion sort of likes, a lion sort of likes, that'd be amazing. Thank you so much. And don't forget to subscribe whilst you're there because subscribing is cool and stuff. Never wants to be cool, right? Anyway. Jack Gallagher is down there. You can see him. I hope, hoping. Please, proc. No, he didn't need to proc. Mankai still beats Goldberg. And Jack Gallagher is OP as hell. Uh, unfortunately, a lot of Jerichos are going to go crazy. We get a bit of chat toast going on. Whose idea was it to do chat toast? I mean, seriously. What a, what a name for something. Could have just called it pop ups. Nope. Um, nope, nope. Had to quit chat toast. Uh, are we going to get a 9 0 hype here? I'm going to put uh, Neville there. Please be 9 0 hype. Speed. Ah, oh, god damn it. Rusev did not want me. Rusev did not want me. We're going to get these final shards. Don't think it matters. I think we should still be able to get this Chris Jericho card. If any of the cards in this ring domination are pro for you, let me know in the comment section below. AJ Styles is not a pro for me. I don't have another one. There's a Stone Cold Steve Austin. Very apt for ring domination. I can't wait to do a Stone Cold Steve Austin RD. Because uh, that'd be amazing. I'm going to actually have one shard left by the end of this. As Nasty Boy Jerry Sags. And here we go. All of us stupid idiots have just been put on the list by Chris Jericho. Drink it in, man. Oh, Chris Jericho, baby. There's Bray Wyatt. Go with a kind of looky-uppy face. Like he's just done the same wrong, but with a very big smile on his face. Uh, but anyway, Chris Jericho. I'm very happy with this card. Very, very happy. And we've got a shed ton of images for this boy. Okay? Now, this image is good alone. Okay? But we're going to have a look at all the different ones we've got. So, we've got the original Chris Jericho from Season 1, I'm assuming. It's Season 1. We've got the one for the Ultra Rare. This one's very, very, very popular. And whilst it doesn't look like it at the moment... When it has the event card, the arm will actually pop out a little bit, like it does on the uh, normal cards. And we've got the Jericho, the Elite, the Epic Jericho. That image doesn't look too bad, actually. That actually looks okay. It looks like a kind of like a, like a character painting of some kind. Jericho from Legendary. That looks good as well. I mean, he he's probably the only one that, like, most of his images actually suit the card. Jericho's got loads of awesome cards that look really, really nice. Are you sure that isn't Gordon Ramsay? It is totally Gordon Ramsay, isn't it? Literally, this is Gordon Ramsay. The way he looks here, it is pretty much Gordon Ramsay. Um, he's got some really good event cards, actually. look really nice on this. We've got part of his shoulder missing Jericho. He doesn't look too good on that one. Uh, I've never really liked most of the, the WrestleMania cards anyway. Chris Jericho from the uh, Legendary event back in Season 1. Again, looks good. 
A stupid idiot sandwich. <laughs> you stupid idiot sandwich! He never wasn't any cards until this one here. That doesn't look too bad. It looks okay. I don't think with the pro it looks too good though. That's the one from the Survivor PCC event. This one will look okay. This is the one from SummerSlam. I wasn't a really big fan, if I'm going to be honest. I thought the one from the Money in the Bank. This one. Smug Jericho. That looks great. That looks awesome. I like it. Ah, this is the one I said I wanted to try. The SummerSlam event card. Looks good. Looks good. Not the best one. It does look pretty decent, okay? You've got the Elite. Not so sure on this one. The Elite doesn't look that great. Not so sure on the Elite throwback. I think that the image just looks a bit of a waste. It's a bit too blended in with the card, if that makes sense. And then you've got the Ultimate. Which doesn't look too bad. I'm going to pick Gordon Ramsay, Jericho. Stupid idiot sandwich, Jericho. We'll just keep it at that. So the Survivor background looks absolutely incredible on this. And that, that, that just suits it so well. And talk about idiot sandwiches. We're going to go over to the Fusion Chamber. Because you have got to get an idiot sandwich... Elite Fusion. We're now going to claim the rewards. Man. Let's do it. Am I going to get Jason Jordan? Because I got Chad Gable on my last one. Now, DIY basically is my first two Harden Fusions. Okay. And I got Chad Gable as my first Elite Fusion. Am I going to get Jason Jordan? Let's claim the rewards. What's going to be? What's going to be? Oh, your apps. I'm calling it now. I'm calling it now. I, I, I'm absolutely certain of it. Okay. Absolutely certain. And I am going to get Tired of Breeze as my ultimate fusion. If it doesn't happen, then I don't know. I'll do something silly. But there we go. Jason Jordan. It's tag team hype. It's tag teams forever. Literally, each tag to every fusion I get is another member of the tag team. Jason Jordan. Great fusion. Love it. Actually, really, really excited about that. And you know what? I'm actually expecting now to get the next fusion to be a uh, Tyler Breeze. I'm expecting it now. We don't need to see the, the finisher because the finisher's already been done. I'm going to check out the image on Jason Jordan. And we're going to put him back in the chamber. Then if you've got yourself an elite fusion, doesn't look too bad actually. I actually prefer this image. I prefer the other Chad Gable image, but I prefer this Jason Jordan image. But we're not going to keep him. He's all got back in the chamber. It's a shame. I like that card. Okay, let's get rid of the other enhancement. There we go. We just get rid of all the enhancements. We get all of the enhancements. Right, let's get these. Um, uh, thank you so much for the sub. Welcome to the Zalivas, man. Okay. Uh, let's go and go for toughness. It's a bit of a waste, but you know what? All those enhancements come finally come to some good use. There we go. Ultimate fusion. And I'm going to speed up. No, I'm genuinely joking. I'm not. 17,000 credits. Not a chance in hell. So if you enjoyed this, remember to leave a huge like on this video. And please let me know if you got yourself any fusions recently in the comments section below. And also don't forget to me know if you've got any pros from this ring domination. If you've got Chris Jericho from this ring domination. If you've got anything, any good pulls from this ring domination. Comment section. And remember to subscribe to the channel using the little link that's going to pop up just down here. And check out the other videos that are going to pop up on my screen. Other ring domination videos, other fusion videos and all that good stuff. So... Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you soon. Check the description below for details to Twitch, Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. And also I've linked in my player.me account. Go check out player.player.me. Definitely a really good, awesome social... Definitely a really awesome social media outlook coming out very soon. So go check it out. And one last thing, and that is to... Zoom!